Okay, so we are going to try streaming some The Walking Dead Saints and Sinners. Uh, this is Lorekeeper Diab, also known as Alora, uh, and I am running this uh, via Oculus Quest 2 on a potato of a computer, so it may not work out, but we'll see what happens. Join the club. Oh, right, I need to be in the game. Hold on. The way. All right. Does this mean they can all hear us? They should, yeah. So watch your dirty whore mouths. Talking to you, Dan. Okay. Who the fuck are you? You need something? Uh. Starvation's gonna take me if I don't eat soon. I don't have food for you, lady. Let's see if I can find something for you. All right, here we go. Hello, gentlemen. Oh, you were fucking for right off the bat. We have one of these guys. How's the stream look, guys? I'm trying. Who the I'm hell's trying. talking to me? Oh, it was Dan. <laughs> this game has people that like talk to you, and I'm not used to having other people on Discord. Um. Okay. I don't believe I'm in Old Town right now. I believe there are some caches here in the Bastion, so. Come on, big guy. She ain't getting back up. Oh, you're going to be helpful. <laughs> oh, son of a bitch. Hey, some food for that lady. How about that? head out and try to figure this stupid computer thing out. Okie dokie. So, have fun everybody. Adios, Sam. See ya.
dudes in body armor. Let's go SWAT. Oop. There we go. Just needed to work on my backswing. I love about this game is that even the lighters are functional. Can I burn the cigarette pack? No, but there are limits to the technology we can use. Jesus, I'm finally in. That was a nightmare. Ah, Laughing Lich Corporation. All one word. I wonder if I can enable chat in game that works oh, it's not gonna work uh, oh. oh look at that it looks pretty good oh yeah it sure does even for this old potato of a computer Hiding out on the roof. You are very much covered in a lot of blood. Meh. Depends on what you consider a lot of blood, I mean. Are you crawling on the ground? No, I'm up now. I what? This is crawling on the ground. Or kneeling, crouching. Hidden tiger. I don't need no cigarettes. Ooh, but I will take that Twinkie. <laughs> they say the Twinkies never go bad. That was a lie. Lie detector determined that was a lie. Why does this say Twinkle Toe? I guess they probably didn't have the rights to use yeah. Twinkie. <laughs> Fair use Twinkie. Lantern is dying. Wake up. Okay. Oh, I forgot I had the axe. A little lag spike there. Oh, okay. Alright, here's what we're doing. Holy moly! Oh. Nobody behind me, that's good. Ooh. Is that a katana? Or are you just. It is. Do you like it? I made it myself. Forged the steel with my bare hands. Very I'm a dancing zombie. Look at me. Oh god, she got me. Whatever 
was no cash in that house. Oh, that <laughs> that happened on the upswing. That was completely unintentional, but you know what? I'll take it. Oop! Hit my drink in real life. Always be careful of your uh, arm span when playing VR, folks. Come on, potato, I know you can do this. Shoes. Computer later. Yeah. I didn't mean anything bad, baby. You're not a potato. You're a clever computer. Get off of me. Come on, you tower fool. Man, that's been some heavy, uh, heavy zombie presence. I do that to those guys is because if they're pale walkers they uh, are diseased and they will reduce your max HP oh didn't pay attention to that guy just like that happened right there you can see the bars on the bottom this guy get eaten nope she's still alive oh just barely though missed it Sorry, lady. But, you know, just in case. <coughs> Fortunately, I don't have any bandages. Okay, who noticed me? What the hell? Whole lot of, whole lot of diseased walkers out today. Okay, well, hopefully we can find a bandage or something around here.
haven't seen the caches. Turn your back on the most needy? That's a sin. I haven't eaten in a week. Hook me up with something. Anything. That'll help. Let me give you this. The, there can be cooperation between survivors. Probably not much. Well, I can cut you open. These guys, because they have a busted gut, you stab them in the stomach. Very well. Cut open their stomach a little. You can grab their innards. Which you can then use to disguise yourself. He's already seen me, so I'll probably have to kill him anyway. But now, unless I kill directly in front of a zombie, or I attempt to run. Zombies should ignore me. And again, I am running this on a potato, so if you are watching, I apologize. But, uh, if you know anything about computers, my uh, PC is running off of a uh, Sabertooth X58 motherboard. So, potato. Oh, not what I wanted. This is the back side of the house that I already looted. Still haven't seen any of these caches. On the main road. I'm not familiar enough with the bastion. To know exactly where they are. We're just going to wander around. Ooh. You look like another survivor. That's another exit, so that's good to know. What's up, my man? Meds, and I know you have some. Don't fuck with me, and no one will get hurt. <sighs> you got him, man. That weapon stays out. Oh. <laughs> You don't start nothing, there won't be nothing. Let's get out of my face before something bad happens to you. Too late. Oh, oh my gosh, this is almost dead. Might have to give up on the caches. These guys heard that shotgun go off. Come on, there we go. I do not have any meds. Alright, yeah, let's, we're gonna call this one, uh, You mean St. Louis, fuckers?
potatoes can still get shit done. Ain't that right, baby? <sighs> All right, back to home base. Nice and safe in the graveyard. ahead and heal up a little here. <sighs> mm. What's up? Show a stream on my end. There you go. It was just really dark. Oh, it's probably in the loading screen. An old town has one of those secrets. Oh, I forgot I have the the upgrade for this. Awesome. Oh, how's my gun looking? Ooh, that. I think I can rack out the shots of this, unfortunately. Yeah, I'll just use that till it breaks. And, alright, so. Ah, oh. Senpai. Alright, I think I think I am ready to go to Sweepies. Delayed. The shallows. I guess that's it. Okay. I need to go to Old Town. Uh, so, Jeremy, why don't you tell us? what your ultimate goal is for Alora. Oh, for Alora? Well, there's a lot of stuff I can't say because it has to do with backstory that hasn't been quite reached in uh, in game. Uh, but, I mean, ultimately, her ultimate goal right now is to find whatever was taken from her, and she can't really remember exactly what that is. But some avid viewers might have some guesses. Oh, what is this? Hello. Um, spades, hearts, 
diamonds and clubs. Oh, if this is a clipboard. Um, but yeah, no, I mean, she's, uh, she's invested in helping Embla regain control of its own. Oh, this is somebody else's property. Hello. Uh, she's invested in getting Embla back into the hands of the dwarves. She's invested in killing some drow. Oh, that was close. <laughs> um, but yeah, she's invested in the war because, uh, due to her backstory, she has a fond, real fondness for dwarves, which hasn't really been gone into. And, uh, fuck her. Uh, and she also has a, uh, a hatred for, uh, hello. <laughs> Uh, a hatred for uh, the more evil underground races. Drowse. In particular, yeah. No one! Pretty sure the Kalor can relate to that hatred. Yeah. <laughs> I, uh, I feel like this is gonna culminate like, Kalor's hatred of Drow is going to culminate eventually until, like, something really bad happens. I feel like the options are either he has the character growth arc with things and all that, or something bad happens. Yup. Lena just wants to get to her fucking village. Right? I mean, she's not planning on leaving us there, is she? No. No. Uh, she's way too invested in everything at this point. But, uh, we've been trying to get to her village for, like, Ten sessions. Yeah. So <laughs> it's really me, I guess, then not so much swirly now. Do you have to chop their heads off, otherwise they rise as zombies? The uh human NPCs, yeah. Obviously the zombies you have to stab in the head. Come on. Do the thing, for crying out loud. Oh, oh, this chick is the one that I left outside without fucking cutting her head off. After I blew your arm off with an explosive arrow. Holy moly. Whew, now I am on day 36, uh, which means the hordes are tougher and more zombies and there's a lot more what are called death squads, which are people like the NPCs here, so obvious. So Kalor. What uh what about Kalor? I know he's super racist, and I know that he hates the drought because he was tortured by them and watched people he loved be tortured by them. And I know there's probably a lot you can't tell us because you got this spy secret uh, organization thing going on that we haven't really touched on. But uh, what about him? Does he just want to kill as many draw as possible? Or I think so. Basically, the n not completely secret secret is that he basically went back along on all this and tried to hook up with everyone down in the Underdark because he's kind of trying to find some more meaning in his life, reconnect with his family and all that. And, uh, he's kind of just... At this point, is kind of just a, a lost soul trying to find some purpose.
purpose beyond just wanting to murderate the drow, but you know, that's kind of a ongoing uh, thing of him fully admitting that's what he's doing and also trying to, you know, focus on something that's not just killing the drow. Yeah, because I remember when you met with the guy in, uh, I think it was in an Embla, one of your, like, people, he was like, oh, are you on a secret mission? Or was, uh, was it in my Balka? I don't remember. And he was like, are you on a secret mission? You're like, yeah, that's what I'm doing here. Secret mission. Yeah, because I basically got a mission that I knew would connect me back up with everyone, but then I, like... Kind of am not. I'm kind of still doing my mission, but not really also. <laughs> so that, hence all the lying. Of like, uh, yeah, yeah, don't, don't tell them too much in the report, because, uh... I'll I don't really have an answer. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I feel so, like uh, there is pretty much hidden recipe in here. Yeah. I was, like, honestly partially convinced that you were just going to stay with the dragon dude. The void dragon. And just be there. But now I don't think that's really an option for you. Although, technically, we went back in time. So we haven't fought the void dragon yet. So there is an opportunity for you to... Unless by some random happen chance, uh, he know he does remember, as he's connected to the void. Fair. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, we got our recipe. Um. What'd you get the recipe for? Gumbo. Oh, like an actual recipe. I thought it was like a recipe to like make a weapon or something. <laughs> this is the house on Walnut Street. I don't know. What am I missing here? Right? There's Walnut. There I am. Locate the cache. Investigate the house on Walnut Street. Well, unless there's another house that's not marked on my map. Go to the house with all the newspapers and look under the cardboard boxes outside of it. Oh, are you are you helping me? Yeah. Did I ask for help? There's a zombie. Coming. <laughs> Do you not want me to help you? Sorry. No, no, no. That was great. Thank you. I was just playing the alpha. We all know who wears the pants and who wears the kilts in this relationship. In this marriage, yeah. <laughs> well, marriage is a relationship. You know you cut out, so I was saying marriage. Oh, okay. <laughs> I just killed myself. Son of a bitch. How so? I w shot an explosive arrow too close to me. Uh, fuck it. Let's respawn. Oh, good. I'm pretty close. Uh, that's a fucking ashtray. I don't know why I didn't pick it up. Nothing around here. Well, shit. We're going to have some fun here, then. I don't like it. I don't like it. Oh, that's...
Thanks, baby. There are all these Goriam zombies seeing me. Jeremy just keeps hitting things. This is why DR is dangerous. All right, you said a stack of cardboard boxes. Where I came in. Oh, that missed. Oh. Get out of here, mister. It is kind of disappointing in this game that you'd never get an option for a crossbow. Considering like how uh, connected that was to the original series. All right, so this is where I came in. Back of cardboard box. Was it inside the house or outside of the house? It was outside. It looked okay. like it was in a yard. This is it. I found it. Oh, those aren't cardboard boxes, but yeah. Box truck. Whistles. I know you got a problem with punctuality. It's kind of your thing, and I get that. I'm not trying to change you anything. But some shit just went down. And if you would have been here on time, we could have had a much bigger score. Just saying. I had to move it because Tara was sniffing around. Had my pack filled when they jumped. I took everything I was carrying. You know me, though. I never carried a whole score in one go. That's a rookie maneuver. I oh, went no, back I dropped and my knife. what was left. Still a hefty chunk. Drew another little piece he can find in your head. I'll be waiting around nearby so we can powwow. Louise. We're looking for a specific box truck, which should have a glowy UV light on it. These guys. Apparently. Oh, it, look at that. It's right there. I got a heart. But what do I do with that? Hello. Hello, yes, I am also a zombie. Hello. Um, don't know what to do with don't this information. Run. I'm not running. I'm walking. But I have this here. I can't open up that truck. See, there's the there's the carpet boxes. Turn around. Oh, I already got the cash. Oh, okay. Uh, and it had a picture of a truck that and the symbols to use my uv light on uh Wait, did you not get in the ambulance no i wonder if there's like a key for it or something oh see there's another one Maybe follow the hearts? Are they the first one was a heart, then a triangle. Or, sorry, then the diamond. Oh, I need to find somewhere where I can reapply. Just like makeup or sunscreen.
Oh, look at that. There's a cache. Not the one I was looking. Not what I'm looking for specifically, but. Yeah, there's the triangle. The one on the ground over here? No, the one that was on the van. No. It was the one that's right here left. All right, hold on. <laughs> oh, I'm getting some real bad lag here. Oh shit, I dropped my shotgun somewhere. <laughs> Run! Shit, fucking goddamn it. Oh. Alright. Well, we have made a successful stream with the VR. Well, at least partially successful. Hi, buddy. Hi. The cat that's telling me to calm down and stop playing video games. So it's good to know. Uh, I will probably try and stream some horror and maybe even stream some... Uh... Baby, how do you feel about doing um, me playing the room and you telling me what to do? Uh, Yeah, I could do that. Rhiannon loves the room games, but she is not so happy with the VR. Yeah, although I did stand when I played. Maybe if I like sat and stayed. Oh yeah. Stagnant, it might be okay. It'll be fun. All right. Well, thanks for joining us on this experimental uh, phase of gaming with Lorekeeper Diop. Um, and talk to you later. That is, if I can locate my mouse.